Hey, hey, you're with Easy Jeezy. We're out in the garage, and I'm here to answer a question. I got a uh, personal message today from somebody, and they were concerned about their distributor drive gear. They had dropped it down the hole, and number one, when it ended up, one spark plug, according to the distributor cap, normally number one is here. They've got it pointing over here, so that number is the number one. It's not really going to change anything. It will run that way. You could split your case if you want to. You can always remember, uh, there is a way when I was doing my 1800 build, before I put the case halves together, you can put the distributor drive gear in. After you've set your camshaft and crankshaft in place, you can put your... Uh, distributor drive gear which is right here down the hole you have to put the washers in first you won't be able to get it in as an assembly like this you have to first tilt your case in the stand you'll see that if you look on some of those 1800 uh, assembly videos the two of these I only found one here because I'm in a rush and this happens to be a spare that I have probably from this case you have to put these two spacers on. I've seen all sorts of things when I took them apart. Only one, but you want to try. The correct way to do this is to put two of these spacers in. That way this isn't riding on the magnesium directly and wearing out your case. The spacers allow you to take up the friction someplace. Now, this is a special tool, and I put a link in it to him and I will follow up with a link in this this is a tool that's about 16 17 dollars from CB performance all the major salespeople that sell Volkswagen parts and sell tools carry this it's got a little ball in there that spreads it apart it fits down inside the recess here and this is this is terrible but I'm and just running out the door and I'm, I'm supposed to meet some folks you tighten it down now because these have a slight angle to them when you set that in place you have to take into consideration it's going to turn to the right a little bit and you want the short side let's take it apart again <laughs> That's, that slot is not in the center. You want the short side to the front. You put your distributor in there. The, on a 009, there's a little line on it. And that should pay face. If it doesn't, it's not going to... It's not the end of the world. But if you're in the assembly stage, it's a lot easier to do it and get it right then than it is to wait. Now, you'll see... Right down here, there's a little line. This is a 009 distributor, but there's a little line in the side of the distributor, and that should point towards your fuel screw. So, do you have to take your case apart? No. If you purchase one of these tools, you can pull it back up. And remember, you're going to have to jiggle it, and you're going to have to have your crankshaft in exactly the same spot it was when you dropped it in where it's going to get hung up and it won't want to come out. I don't know what else I can tell you. It's standard stuff. If you've got one of those uh, Volkswagen books for the complete idiot, the John Muir books, I think he goes into detail on it. Uh, I think this uh, builder actually mentioned he had a Wilson's uh, book. I'm pretty sure uh, that's the same one I have. It's got a red cover on it, and I think that guy does a pretty good job of, of showing assembly. It's not the end of the world. It just means number one spark plug is, is going to be over one. Instead of being this being number one, this is going to be number one. One, four, three, two. I've had them. I've had engines that I purchased uh, that were in cars and assembled wrong. You know, it, it, they still ran. Not a big deal. It's going to confuse the heck out of the next guy till he, uh, you know, if he doesn't know anything about it. But uh, it'll work. So everything else gets the same way. So don't panic. You do what you think is right. 
Thanks for watching. Thanks for subbing. Easy jeezy.